there mm-hmm. was a project they done recently okay. where in uh, they went to different families and saw what books they were have having I see. because you know it's kept like a family heirloom those manuscripts belong to my great grandfather and i don't know what's in them but they're kept carefully so that way they had them and uh, when these agraharas you know agraharas in uh, south india mm-hmm. are the places where the brahmins used to live okay. and teach because uh-huh. the agrahara was also like an educational institution because in all these brahmins houses mm-hmm. uh, students could go and learn from them in their houses mm-hmm. so there will be a veranda in front where the teacher would sit and the students will all learn from them okay and uh, adjacent houses they are teaching different subjects i see <laughs> <laughs> so it's imagine in the in the middle of the street there will be a debate going on because okay. this student has just come out from here uh-huh. studied something and there's another stu- so they meet on the way they are discussing and debates would happen spontaneously in the gharas mm. right uh, and so all of them used to maintain the manuscripts so there was a project where the those were being scanned and they were being looked up to see okay. what they contain mm-hmm. but i am also told that a lot of these manuscripts were sold like raddi when ah, people had to move i see because they had to vacate a lot of these uh, agraharas are no longer agraharas okay. right they are now shops there and, and they have been taken over by the other you know the demography mm. change the demographic changes that are happening so a lot of agraharas have gone to the other communities and so these uh, manuscripts were given away as raddi and because they are thinking it's not useful to us they are now educated in english mm-hmm. today's generation and yes. they are thinking what is there it's not going to be useful to me mm-hmm. and they give it to me that's sad so so we had gurukuls and we had these uh, these educational centers where you would teach skills yeah. and was this spread all across india all across india okay north south east west